Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well. I'm back in my Erin Condren doing another one of my, I, I don't know what to call this, like sectioned out planning. I had a weird face a few weeks back and um, I tried a bunch of new things and I really like how this one turned out. So I've been doing it for all of the subsequent weeks. So Monday is May the 4th, so I wanted to whip out these Star Wars um, full boxes from my shop. It's not like a full mini kit, I just made some full boxes. I'm only planning the first half of the week for now, but I just put down the foiled um, bow headers from Two Little Bees up top, and I also picked out some thin washi from Simply Gilded. I thought these colors matched the full boxes really well, so um, I just ripped them up and used my X-Acto knife to cut them down to size. I also picked out four of the full boxes for the first half um, and of course I put down the May the 4th be with you on the 4th. Moving on to the sidebar, I took this twinkle twinkle washi from my shop and once again trimmed them to size and then on the space above I put down a unicorn working onesie sticker for my shop to mark in that I wanted to work on some custom emojis which at the end of the video are going to put in some clips of me working on um, some of the customs so you can see my process. But yeah, only having full boxes for this spread was kind of challenging but also um, pretty cool to be able to pull in a lot of leftover things like the bow headers from two little bees and also a bunch of washies. I only get to use like a few strips of washi for my bullet journal spreads um, and I really do want to use them more so um, something like this is really awesome for using up your planner supplies. And then for the sidebar I just wrote down a little checklist of some things that I want to do and the color for Tombows that I'm using is N60. It's supposed to be like a medium gray, but it looks really dark actually. And then for Monday, I put down a sticker from my May the 4th sampler to mark in May the 4th. And I also drew in some sparkles because I thought that would be really cute and funny. So what I've been doing lately is for the top section, I just make little bullet points of things that I need to do and, and I just cross them off as I go. And usually the middle section, I um, put down my character stickers and icons and um, stagger them a little bit. But because I really wanted to pull in these full boxes, um, I put the full boxes in the middle and then all of the icons at the bottom. I put down this house doodle sticker from my shop to mark in that I wanted to sign my contract to extend my lease for this apartment and then I put down this sort of A plus girl sticker from Frank Hearts You to mark in that summer school actually starts on Monday. It totally crept up on me. It'll be online so that's kind of interesting. And then I put down a heart bow sticker from uh, The Giving Girl to mark in that I want to email some of the custom people. Then for Tuesday, once again, I just wrote down my list and because I'm spending so many hours of the day just drawing customs and doing work and stuff, um, I want to try audiobooks again. I don't know why, I just never really, I guess, got into it. Um, I feel like if I'm doing something while listening to audiobooks, it's just hard for my brain to sort of keep things organized, like I can't really follow the story. Um, but yeah, I just want to try it again this week. Uh, so I put down a stitch label from Blank Slate Stickers along with this um, headphones emoji from my shop. Then I put down a FaceTime sticker from Willa Willa Co. just to mark in that I want to FaceTime my sister. And then I layered a glitter laptop from Little Miss Papery on top of a circle heart icon from Clever Gal Crafts to mark in that once again I want to email the finished files to the customs people. On Wednesday, I do have some photos that I plan on editing, so I layered a photography emoji on top of a desktop sticker from Chic Streak Sticker Boutique to mark in that I want to edit the photos. Then I put down a Cleaning Ninja sticker, which I thought was really funny, and I also put down a lettering sticker from Randy.Plans next to that. Wednesday is a little bit bare, but probably on Tuesday, I will just like completely fill it out. Um, and then, yeah, that's about it for this spread. I'm pretty sure I have some footage of me working on the customs, so I will insert this after I finish up the sidebar. I hope you enjoy this video, and I will see you next week. Bye, everyone! Okay, so the first thing I do is go through their form and um, write down in my notebook what exactly they want. So I just wrote down a mind map of all of their information. 
Um, she has two cats, so I just made sure to put that on the side. And I'm extra excited about this one because this person wants a fountain pen, and I love fountain pens. So I normally have a lot of reference photos on the side of the people that I'm drawing, but of course I'm not going to put that on the screen right now. She's also an author, so she's going to be holding her own book, which is super cool. And then she has two cats, so I think I'm just going to put them on this side and I kind of want to put them like on top of each other just sort of like lean around like cats do I don't know I think that would be cute I love the custom start off with a sketch like that I'm gonna try to do the coloring with one hand um, it's actually kind of difficult hopefully this is kind of interesting to watch So she talked about wanting like a sweater cardigan, so I'm going to add some like texture. She also wanted some earrings, so... Okay, that's a terrible circle. Okay. That's much better. It's supposed to be like a longer oval. And put it side and this is a final product i really like how this one turned out this one took quite a long time but i'm super happy with the cats um so yeah that's basically my process for these customs i just finished this one and it's so pretty i don't know why i'm whispering it's already past midnight so i feel like i should be whispering but um i think i'm gonna draw two more and then 